One of my favorite podcasts is Barbecue and Tech with Chris Ashley and Rod Simmons. So we had to stop by the GE booth right away to see the uh, GE Profile Smoker. Yes. I'm, I'm talking to Andre Zdanov. That's correct. Great to meet you. Yeah, and welcome to the to the GE Profile Smart Indoor Smoker with active smoke smoke filtration. Okay, so I'm going to warn you up front. This is an audio podcast. Okay. But some people will watch video. So describe everything in detail. What are we looking at here? All right. So this is a countertop oven that is a wood pellet smoker. So it, what truly makes it the first of its kind is the active smoke filtration technology that we've brought into the product. It catalyzes the smoke to remove almost all the particulate and carbon monoxide so that it's safe to use inside the home. Okay, that was gonna be my very first question, but I gotta tell you, wafting towards me, yeah. nobody on audio or video is smelling what I'm smelling come up in that smoker. So you get the smell, but you're not getting the particulate. That's correct, not the particulate, you're not getting the unhealthy CO, you're getting mostly just vapor, de minimis particulate, some CO2, so it's safe to have in the home, but you are gonna smell good home cooking. Yeah, there you go, so it looks like a, a tall square microwave oven to me is the way I'd describe it in size. Yeah, that's a fair way to put it. A bit like a countertop oven, but flipped on its end, so it's a little taller than it is wide. Right, right. So how does this work? I see uh, some nice uh, displays and a dial that's going around and something delicious cooking. Yeah, that's so, all I know so far. Yeah, so we have about an eight pound pork butt in there. Well, how big is that today, chef? So we've got a seasoned eight pound pork butt in there. And so this is a wood pellet smoker. One of the other things that's interesting about it is because it's a countertop oven, it's electric, it doesn't use the wood pellets as a heat source. So we consume very few pellets. You're able to dial in how much or how little smoke flavor that you want in the product. So for those who are watching, this is the pellet hopper where you would load your pellets in the top. Um, and I will mess with things as I do that. And so we have a nice auger that moves those pellets past the igniter and gets them to just uh, release the sweet aromas and flavors that you just love. The first thing to burn in wood are the sugars. And that auger will move the pellet down to our waste bin here in the bottom right of the unit. And we have the user fill that with water we extinguish that pellet while it's still an ember. And that lets us get all those sugars, all those sweet flavors and aromas, but not the acrid or sour flavors that you would get if you burn it down to ash. So we're extinguishing them first. Okay, okay, that makes sense. So um, I'm gonna I'm gonna mess with you here. Chef Dallas McGarity is on the side here. What it, What is it we're cooking here? So we have about an eight pound pork butt in there. I rubbed it down with my barbecue rub and just popped it in there with some of the Kona pellets and we got it going. So I'm guessing that you use a quote unquote real smoker from time to time, right? Oh yeah, this is, you know, this is for personal use mainly for me at home, you know, but I'd have the big smoker outside, but it's a lot more of a mess and, you know, takes a little bit more of my time to work on it. So this is easy for me to do at home and I got the app and I can look at it on, online and all that stuff, so it's easy. So you can still do the creativity part of making a, a smoked meat, but not have to go outside and, and uh, and deal with the timing issues as much because this is more automated? It's more automated. It's also more consistent because the heat is more consistent than what you have to mess with outside. So outside you're messing with the heat over and over and over. This, it's a very consistent heat, so you know it's going to be done at a certain amount of time. So it helps a lot when you're planning dinner for four people at home, you know? Right. And so it is about four people at home. I mean. If they weren't Americans, you could probably get 16 people, but four, four of us, I'm thinking you could get off this pork butt. So this is all app attached and all that kind of stuff? It, it is app attached. That's going to allow us to continue to drive continuous improvement to the product. That's one of the things GE Profile is known for with our smarter products. The app lets us launch updates and also some guided cooking with some of our products. But it also really allows you to be kind of the master of your domain because you're going to get alerts as to what's the temperature of the thing that I'm cooking. We have an integrated probe in there that's sitting in that pork butt. So chef knows exactly what that internal temperature is, whether he's multitasking, answering the door, mowing the lawn, um, and it'll let you know if you need to empty your waste bin, add pellets. So it really lets you be in control without having to be as hands-on. Oh, that's a nice compromise. So um, what you just recently released this just recently, right? That's correct. It's just launched at retail here in January. Um, it's rolling out at retailers nationwide. Um, suggested retail sale price is $9.99 and it is a brand new launch for us. It's really, really exciting. I know we've done a little bit of smoking here. Uh, Steve has done some smoking inspired by Barbecue and Tech, kind of give them another plug. But the idea of bu buying a big outdoor smoker has been kind of prohibitive for us. He's got a question here. You could buy it now? Yes, I believe you can buy it now. Is yes, you can buy it now. It's shipping now, multiple retailers nationwide. 
That's fantastic. Well, um, I'm just going to get off here and find out when uh, Chef McGarrity's going to be done. Get me a little bite of that pork belly. That sounds fantastic. Enjoy the rest of your show. Thank you. All right. You. And where would people go to find this? Um, it's available at Best Buy, Williams Sonoma, Amazon, um, many retailers, Crate and Barrel as well. Very good. Very good. Thank you very much, Andre. My pleasure. Thank you.